We're here in London to find out how our taxi drivers respond to the sound of the new TX, the electric vehicle, versus the old diesel TX4. What we might expect is that our drivers will be more relaxed in the quieter electric vehicle than in the chuggy, noisier diesel. So in order to do this experiment, we took four experienced London taxi drivers and we put them through a series of trials, both in the diesel cab and the electric cab, uh, through a short route in the centre of London. What we're going to do is use a range of biophysiological measures, in particular something called the electroencephalogram, which is a kind of swimming cap with electrodes attached to it. This allows us to see particular patterns of brain activity that might be associated with feeling stressed or concentration and we're also going to look at other measures for example galvanic skin response which is how sweaty their fingertips are and their, their heart rate and their heart rate variability. After each trial we asked the drivers to complete a short survey describing how angry, afraid, calm, stressed or distracted they felt during the drive and what we found was that they generally felt happier and less stressed in the electric vehicle. So then we took a look at the biosignal responses. What we might have expected is to see higher rates of alpha band activity in the brain responses to the electric vehicle. Alpha bands are correlated with restful states of mind. But in fact, what we found was higher rates of beta activity, which tend to be correlated with concentration and active thought processes. So how do we explain these high beta waves? One theory is that the drivers aren't having to listen to these droning diesel engines anymore and this frees them up to concentrate more when they're in the electric vehicle. So then we looked at the heart rate variability of our drivers. High heart rate variability is generally correlated with stressed states of mind. Our drivers had a much lower variability in their heart rate in the electric vehicle. So this suggests that our drivers felt calmer or more relaxed. These drivers can spend up to 12 hours a day in their vehicles. Talking to them over the course of the day, it's clear that they find the new electric vehicle much less fatiguing than the old diesel one. And our results give us some indication of why that might be. 